welcome back to our iMonitor tutorial video series. In this video, we are dedicated to the precise creation, use and editing of guidelines. After selecting a field, the associated master lines are displayed and the last used guidelines are activated. The system uses the working width of the implement and takes into account to set overlap to determine the distance between parallel lines. The closest guideline to the tractor is displayed in red, while parallel lines are displayed lighter. The selected master line is highlighted by a black line with endpoints. There are several ways to change the master lines. With the Cycle Master Line button, the iMonitor offers you a simple method of switching lines. This is AUX and enabled and can also be placed on its own button on the armrest for maximum convenience. Alternatively, swipe over the master line on the map. As soon as this is highlighted, you release your finger and activate it. The eye monitor also offers an automatic function. This always suggests the optimal guideline in the vicinity of your tractor and applies it after confirmation. If it's necessary to shift the guidelines, open the line nudge menu. After entering the offset, you can use the arrows to move them in the respective direction. Alternatively, you have the option to center the parallel lines to the current tractor position. To create new master lines, open the guideline menu. The eye monitor allows you to create the following types parallel AB line, curve line and pivot line. After selecting the guideline type, a sub-menu opens, which allows you to define the endpoints. The simplest guideline type is the AB straight line. Set the A point and start working. To create the master line, set the B point. For an optimal working result of the automatic guidance, this should be set as late as possible. After completion, notifications will appear to activate the new master line and rename it. If you prefer to follow a contour, the curve option provides the solution. The icon opens a menu with options to start, stop, pause, resume or cancel recording. Start recording and drive the tractor along the desired path. The resulting route appears as a black line on the map. Stop recording at the desired endpoint. Curve guidelines are created similarly to pivot lines, but here you drive around the center of the field during recording and a pivot line is created after completion. Note that for curves and pivot lines only the nearest parallel line to the tractor is displayed. To use the automatic guidance, deactivate the road mode and press the Easy Steer activation key. From now on you can work with the automatic guidance. You activate this by pressing the Auto Steer button on the armrest or touching the grey button in the eye monitor. Once activated, the tractor will automatically follow the closest guideline, which is highlighted in dark red. This concludes this tutorial video. Discover also our other videos to learn useful tips and tricks about the iMonitor.